okay. What is good, friends? Back with the men's me. Let me switch sides, Mr. Jam The Jam Vet is here. Everybody, well, slam that like button. We need to hit that 10, team is cool. Subscribers after this video. You what? Got the... What did you say? To <laughs> Ten thousand subscribers, twenty-five thousand likes. The Jam Vet is here. It is time. <laughs> okay, calm down. I'm so. so there's Char Y, most likely. Yeah. You for default. Uh, CB Tar, Rox, Pharaoh, uh... Is Bedef still or...? Maybe, actually. It might be Sash, Doug, Z, Moose, I mean, Steeler, Fist Def, Stella, Stella would help versus Double Dance Land the matchup. Why does Jamvet always use some wild shit? He has Feral Thorn and Stella, Stella. I mean, he has a Duck Tree to get rid of opposing Magnus Zone, so he should be fine in that sense. It's gonna be yeah. Manectric doesn't do. Manectric doesn't do too much, but can vault in the. Because Mew, Mew plus Feral Thorns just walls everything. Mm. I mean, he only has one brain abuser, so I'm not sure. You think he specs Pelipper? Yeah. Did he really ask if Mew is popular? Yeah, I don't so, know. Mew, I guess yeah. my man hasn't been playing Sun and Moon. I mean, maybe he's lately. joking. No, that's fine. Yeah, this Belucha, is a pretty bad. The Lucha looking like a threat. Yeah, but I mean, yeah, but just, if he's Fist of Stealer, that should be fine. Just don't know yet. That's probably um all out pummeling type of leather. I don't see another theme of user besides Lily. Lead with your Manectric already. Okay. Yep. So I assume Gem is gonna go into Mew here. I would have led with Tar. Because the main lead is so unbelievably obvious. Yeah, I get that the Zazzle was obvious because that could have changed the weather from the Pelipper. So he's probably gonna vote switch. Yeah, see, this thing could have been dead turn mm. one because I'm pretty sure this dies to Bandage Suit. Oh, not with Intimidate. Oh, yeah, you're right, Intimidate. Oh, then I. If he's Sash Doug, I would have led with that. So I assume he's gonna go into Pelipper or Halucha. I guess Tapu Lily is an option, but Tapu Lily would give Gem with the switch in. Of Mew or Celestina. I mean, Pelipper is probably gonna be slower because most of them like a slow U turn. Unless it's the offensive Pelipper with uh, specs. I think those might like. He's just gonna go Feral Thorn here. I'm not sure. Probably turn the timer on. These people are taking forever to play. I don't know. What if he has fire punch on Tita? So I don't think he's going feral. Okay. So I mean, it's not really common, but he could be fire punch Tita. Okay, I'd go so here. All out pummeling of Fox Blast is pretty obvious. I mean, he has a fellow stealer. Yeah, Mew would cover a pot potential double switch into Manectric. Also, I think the Doug is Z move because he didn't harden into it. Okay. Yeah, I don't see any other Z potential Z move use. Uh, like, and uh, like Celestia is probably defensive on this. It's definitely Z move, Doug, for for his Charizard wider to like trap. To get rid of Chansey and stuff. And I mean, yes, Tita too, but like, Tita doesn't trap Chansey that reliable. Now it's for Pex. Okay. Okay. I mean, if he has Giga Vault Havoc and blows the Celestia away, but you said you I was thinking <laughs> it could be like Z Thunder or something because he has the rain as well. I've I don't only, know what the other I've only seen that be. set um, Z Thunder twice ever, and I've seen so many Tapu Lilies. Ooh, Jamvet never misplays, I guess, as uh, someone might say. I'm looking for the Charizard Wasp. Yeah, yeah, but what is there's a Pelipper, bro. I mean, that doesn't matter, the weather, the weather changes. If he goes Pelipper, the weather changes back. Yeah. 
It's Fire Blast is gonna be like 80 something. No, it's like 60, it's a pillar bomb, maybe 65, I don't know the color. Right. Dude, it has like uh, base 65. You can just sack the You can go Kingdra on a Fire Blast, because it's 4 times resistant, and pivot into pillar maybe. He's not Fire Blasting. Well, think? if he's not fire Oh, blast, you think he's going for it. Solar Beam or what? Because it covers Kingdra and... I would Solar Beam, Okay. I don't know what's going through Jam's... That was a nice play I'm, from I'm Jam. I'm Fire Blast here. I'm clicking a Fire move here. It was a nice play from Jam because no one's, no one's Psychic moves here. You would either go Steela or... Or you would either predict the... Yeah, you the predicted the Mew, exactly. Or you, predict, or you would predict the fucking Steel. Like he didn't want to go for Psychic Stab because he has like 3 resists and 1 immunity to that. I mean immunity was right in the face to the Lele. Oh, it's right in front of it. So this a Lucha, what is it gonna be? Because I've seen... I guess it could be the Sub Citrus set. Oh, he oh, pivots into Ferrothorn. Dang, Fire Blast would have been so icy there, so now he's gonna go Pelipper. I'll no, never question you. Beats plays. I'll go Tita here. No, because Titar uh, comes in before the Pelipper, so the Pelipper resets uh, the rain. I'd go Pharaoh here. Yeah, but even if the Pel Tita sets the. As long as Tita outspeeds Pelipper, it's kind of not that bad for Jim. I'd just go Pharaoh and get my rocks up. Yeah, that's kind of a good play. Like, I don't see Dexy doing anything other than. Either, Fire clicking, either clicking Protect or going Pelipper, but they don't really run Protect the Ferrothons on Rain. Run like Spikes and Lichy. Power Whip knockoff. Most of the time. Wait, what? what? Fuck, I don't, don't do this, he doesn't want the timer on. <laughs> I don't do this stuff. I guess he's he's saying he doesn't do World Cup to play fast. See, there goes Tita on the oh Manectric. What? Why did did he break the Feral Stone or why did he go Manectric? That was so wild. he got fire, so he got with fire pursued in here speed. or Crunch? Yeah, pursued. It's going to be like yeah, exactly. I was about to say seventy, but that chat is going wild, of course. So he's gonna get up hazards here. Mew's gonna whisper Defog. Probably Defog. Yeah, Defog is important for that. Why, obviously. And yeah, knockoff, like I said, they carry that on rain. And lefties are Mew gone. It's gonna be annoying. So I guess he can Roost or Will O Wisp. Uh, yeah, Softball, same thing. Hmm. This Mew looking like it just so falls if everything. It, if it's Spec Spiller Bar. He has to predict between Hydro Pump and Hurricane, so between going Celesteel and Ferrothorn. But I can also see the Pillar just going for. Sex Pelly run Hydro, Scald, Hurricane, U turn? Yeah, I've seen earlier one with Surf. Condra used one with Surf. So I would just U turn here, anyways. Just yeah, good U turn is fine, what, then. What his initial thought process is yeah. versus the Pillar Like, I just. I'm not sure if he's like defensive, if he would outspeed the Mew. You'd probably be slower, yeah, because Mew usually runs Because, like, speed. if he stays in, if he stays in, you go Kingdra. If he goes Pharaoh, you go main. If he goes Gila, you go main. So, it yeah, turns like, pretty win win. The only way I see a pillar being faster if it's a, if it's Timid Max. And even then, I'm not sure. So, the initial switch in is Zard. Yeah, okay, that was. SCU turns. Mm. I mean, Manectric doesn't. This is a roll, but yeah, Gem obviously wants his art, so he's probably not gonna risk the roll. I could see, I could see HP Ice. He can go. Mm, do you get Tita here? Oh. Oh, Tita's low. You don't want the yeah. He, this is a. I mean, I can't see him going for HP Ice because the dog is in the back, but um, I would probably. Doesn't mute. Nope. Yeah, Mew comes in, so he's probably... He's not T-Volting, he's Volt Switching. He's probably Volt Switching, like... but if the Dagi comes in on the Volt... 
<laughs> you only... Nah, he needs the dog tree. Oh my he god! Do it. Gem Vet is unstoppable. Like I told you, I would have HP. Is that how you would have HP? I mean, it's a 50 50. Scarf Duggy. Scarf. I mean, yeah, but like. That means Z move Steela. It is a 50 50, but who goes hard into that? Like, I would HP is fearing it, but I would never think that he would go hard into it. It's Z move Steela, by the way. Okay. Someone knows the team or what? what no, just... it's Scarf Doug. Yeah, yes. Yeah, no, I'm just wondering if someone told you or if you just thought it because of that. But yeah, it makes sense. It would make sense, is what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I mean, doesn't that kind of get... I guess maybe he's, he's Z, just going to go back to Pelipper. Maybe Z Edge because he's so zap weak. I mean, yeah, he has Tita and... Mm, yeah, Zad, like, Zapdos is definitely annoying. But like, it's a nice double, but it doesn't get him anywhere. Like that is not. It's annoying to Gem's team, but he doesn't like auto lose to it. Something's getting the seeds here. Wait, what? Why was Skull to play? Oh, of course. Okay, we're getting rid of Spexy. That's what I said uh, earlier. He only has one rain abuser. Um. You were right. You were right, Doc Rich. Mm -hmm. Oh, who hits? That's 50%. So lucky. Hits the hurricane. Come on. It's 50. You could have said Jam was lucky if he dodged. <laughs> you, just, you, you just roost up and dodge this one anyway. I mean, he got the 30% skull burn and he hit the 50% hurricane. So that's pretty lucky that to get those both in a row. Both those. Uh, so is U turning? Oh, no, he's, no, he lost his specs. So he, he could have U turned there. I don't know about that skull play. Um. Oh, this this Zardwa is a huge threat because the Pelly something's doesn't about happen. the data like fire blast. Except mm -hmm. this, the, the, the good chunk considering the re four times resist. If the Steel is offensive, he doesn't have good switch ins, especially with the Pharaoh being burned. I mean, the sun's Pharaoh up, still so comes in on pump easily, but like. Oh, justice. <laughs> that would have done like. That would have healed. 15. Yeah. This looking like a 6 0 by the mincemeat. No, I don't think 6 0, but like. Not we should win this. So this is getting up rocks. Yeah, I've never seen smoke this chat be so wild at this time. It's like 2 a.m. here. I mean, I know for Americans it's not that late. Last time I remember the smoke this chat going wild like this was, I think, SPL finals. Jan bad like could get rocks up right now and they'd be like, oh my god, OMG, expert plays by Jambad. <laughs> Tactical stealth rock. With how much he concerns... Oh, he actually rocked? <laughs> he always talks about how when people use like four times weak to rock mines, like they always rocks and he disagrees on it, but... Yeah, but the thing is... is like... I guess with how much he's been switching around rocks up isn't bad. And it's not like he's ever bringing his feral for yeah, in. See, I told you the the mm. chat went nuts. Okay, on that so rock, I think but... he can flamethrower again because no hydro specs. Okay. Wait, he specs defog. That's not a set. Okay, solo him this time. Makes the correct play. Kills Goodbye. The it's over. <laughs> oh, yeah. So if I didn't it's mention it, Jamet is playing for UK and Dexy is playing for Brazil. Man said lol that killed. I mean, it's a Zadwa. And, and the Pelipa is of. Well. Pelipa has like pretty trash but def. I think like 70? Uh, 65, I believe. Base 65. I'm pretty sure this is modest as well because he's flamethrower. Could be modest. I mean, he has a mute to check Medicham, so modest um, would be understandable. 
the Lele, I mean, the Lucha is like the seed, right? I mean, he doesn't have electric terrain, like he doesn't have a Coco, so I don't psychic. think... No, he has psychic terrain. Oh, he has psychic terrain. It, it raises the spadef by one stage. Oh, I don't know about that one. I only knew about the other one. Okay, so he predicted the potential pivot into Pharaoh Thorn there. Um, watch him flamethrower again on the Pharaoh now. Hmm. I'm not sure, like... I get the flamethrower play, but he didn't really lose anything from seeding there. See, he isn't Z-move stealer. Mm. So he probably doesn't, yeah, he just doesn't have a Z-move. Wait, did I just disconnect? Okay guys, I did disconnect, what happened? My fast net died, I switched to my slow net now. He leech seeded the uh, Kindra. Switch on the top, Lily on the pro Protect or decides decides where switch the switch on the top lane and protect from the cell sealer. So it says he gets to protect again, then he uh, focus blast reveals um switches into Tita on a Gigavolt Havoc, dies into Gigavolt Havoc into Moonblast, and now he brings out a Zadway, so we are back live. And I can't afford to call because this internet is really 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 bad. But I will at least try to get the lobby chat back for you guys. Um, I'm really sorry about this. Man, like I said earlier, man, other recording, uh, actually, my other recording will go back up after this. My net um, dies at night sometimes. I can't do anything about it. So he did kill the teacher, so there goes the dream of the 6 0, but we don't need a 6 0. I just want to see Jammed win. Mm, so flamethrower versus solar beam here. How healthy is the Kingdra? Kingdra is at 55. I think I will just flamethrower here. This is insane. I had to like grab my mic and my laptop and walk through the entire house. Because the Wi-Fi... Oh yeah, like I said, I would have flamethrower there. He predicted solar beam. Goodbye, Ferrothorn. Jam at the guard. My wife only works downstairs, so I had to really grab my laptop and I really, I'm holding my mic in my hand. It's, it's stupid. But yeah, what is this Lily even doing? So he pivots into Kingdra to start the sun turn. But he's basically just trying to make the game a little bit closer. I don't think Dexy can come back from this. I mean, this doesn't even outspeed start without the sun up exactly. Uh, without the rain up. Yeah, this game is just over. So he gets this bedev boost from the psychic terrain thing, from the psychic seeds. And this does kill, because he does have a full power acrobatics immediately. But yeah, Mew just has to connect the Willow SP and the game should be over. Um, I think they run SD, Drain Punch, Acrobatics, High Jump Kick. Not sure if they run substitute, but if they run substitute, um, I can see Jamrit being. Um, maybe he has psychic or ice beam. He goes forwards and he connects. So if that would have missed, I would have thrown my computer out the window. Thankfully, he connects. Just happy that my net is back. It's a slow, shitty net, and I have to like hold my mic in my hand because I don't have a, f I don't have a, um, I don't have a desk here. It's really annoying. I hope the audio is still fine. I just hit f something. But yeah, Mew can... Like he's forced to attack because the next item is going to kill. And uh, Acrobatics is going to do like... Maybe 55 to the Mew. Maybe... Fi nah, not that much. Maybe f maybe 48. <laughs> Blonda, tell me you wish they're expecting no substitute. I mean, most of them don't run sub. And I think Jem pretty much had to bank on this not having sub, because if he had sub... 
That would have been pretty dangerous. Like, yeah, he could have gone for Ice Beam, but if he goes for Ice Beam there and this doesn't have sub and gets his SD up without being burned, this can completely destroy you. So you think you had to with there. Yeah. Yeah, James Tenno on World Cup, everyone is saying it. He was um, 9 0. I think last three years he always went 3 0 in round 1, but his team never made it past round 1. Which uh, is definitely annoying, but yeah. What can you do? I mean, he's playing for UK. They have some okay players, or some good players even, but I haven't really followed World Cup in the last years. Uh, but yeah. Jambit is like considering here if if he wants to ice beam or softball, I think. I really hope my net doesn't die again. Because for Drain Punch, that was not the play, my dude. And yeah, he ice beams. And now he can softball here. He's just gonna die to burn. And this game's over. How else is the Cell Stealer, by the way? 75 still. Um, mm, I guess he didn't want to risk anything random happening, so he just went for Ice Beam. He has a Celestine in the back, so he should win anyway. And he has a Scarf Duck to you. Yeah, Scarf Duck to you should kill Lily from 76 with Earthquake. So I assume he's just gonna go Duggy and click Earthquake here to end the game. He can also go Steel and click Heavy Slam, obviously, but I thought he would end with Duggy. That's fine. <laughs> yeah, he has Thunder, but like. This shouldn't kill if he's a death. They already used up the Z move. I think we even mentioned the Gigavolt Havoc earlier, so we're actually nice. We got the sets correct. Yeah. He <laughs> switched back out. <laughs> Man's preserving. Focus Blast, and there's the Power Whip. I mean, not that it matters. I think he's just. Now he's guaranteed in range to die from Dougie. GG was no match. I mean. I think Jamet had better matchup, but hard into hard into Duck Shield. That was a wild play. I don't know if I would have made that play. But the Jamet is gonna play two more games this World Cup. I'm kinda sad because I won't be able to upload this immediately because my net just died my fast net and my yeah he's gonna have quick and finish it up. So he was just making sure in case this is some weird bulky layer that he killed it guaranteed, I guess. Yeah, Jamet picking up the win for team UK. And uh, Dexy, I don't, I think he's like more of an old gen player. I'm not sure why he's put into Sunmoon OU, but there has to be some reason to it. Because before the game started, I saw him um, in the lobby chat, and he said, "Since when is Baton Pass banned?" Like he didn't know that Baton Pass the move is banned. Like if you see this, no offense to you, but I'm just wondering how he doesn't know that. Like the move got uh, banned at Sunmoon, like. I think like a month or so back, like, it actually has been a while, maybe it has probably been more than a month. But yeah, people are sleeping here, I should um, end it now, because I'm here on the floor, people might hear me, I just walked down. Uh, thank you guys for watching, um, I had my man, sorry, and my man T in the call for like the... 60% of this maybe? And then, yeah, my net just decided to drop. Like for, after 20 seconds I realized, or like after a minute I realized the smoke was shit. Like after a few seconds I already realized the smokers chat isn't moving, what the fuck is happening and then I realized the call is gone like X tend to fucking grab my computer and run down and try to catch the rest of the game live Cause you know, you know no one likes three plays, we wanna see it live, we wanna see the smokers chat Pretty sure someone else also recorded this But yeah, it's fine <laughs> I'm a mentee, when I grow up I wanna be jam fed Thank you guys for watching and I mean I could let the smokers chat record for a little bit longer cause this is funny to watch Wait, when do you ever see smoke this jet go so wild? Jim that just has to join it, they go insane. And um, we have Jamet's other opponent is um like one of his other two opponents is Flame Victini. And I'm not that match is gonna be super hype. And I'm not sure which one is, is our last opponent. Um I'm not sure if Jamet will actually cover this and talk about this on his own channel, but I guess he might. We will see. Uh, he actually might do that, yeah. So that would be cool to see, and yeah, thank you guys for watching.
hope you all enjoyed and like in general you got a lot more world cup coming later i record a lot of games before this that i will upload after this game and yeah doc Rich signing out have a nice day and jam with the god picking up the win for uk good bye friends <laughs>